Welcome back to Satisfactory. We had a pretty good time last episode putting together a bunch of bombs, playing around with the bombs a little bit. But now, finally, some might say, we're going to get back on track. We're going to build these supercomputers so we can unlock nuclear power all right and then as a secondary treat we're gonna actually unlock the nuclear power and then we're gonna start in on some of the components necessary for nuclear power to kick off now, supercomputers are not cheap to build. Let's... Uh-oh. If we look at the supercomputer recipes that we have access to, should just be the one. Two computers, two AI limiters, three high-speed connectors, and a chunk of plastic. So, four components. We want room for something like this, right? We want to dump the completed supercomputers. Out. Ship those downstairs. Matter of fact, let's go ahead and set that up so we don't cause ourselves too much distress trying to remember what we were thinking. Take it in to send it downstairs. All right, and then again, while we're thinking about it, we'll just set that to supercomputer. And then, hey, let's just go ahead and connect it to power. Now here, we've got four ingredients. So we know, I need to give myself a little bit more access to power here so I can keep flying. So we know we're gonna have a need for four items, which means we need space for three splitters. One, two, three, and then the splitters we're going to keep go here. And then as an additional, I know that I have a secondary thing that I want, the staters. But that's for bonus round if there's time. Then we need three more holes. Uh-oh. One of these is built too low. Ah, uh, this one is messed up. 
change that. Okay. So the only one that I really care about is I want to make sure that the second level one is a I limiters, I think. That's what we're going to do. We're just going to have to cross our fingers that that's right. And then from here... Highest one. Lowest one goes the farthest away. All right, and then let's just imagine for a moment. What it, if I wanted to take two items off this belt, I could theoretically go up one more, but I think it makes more sense to All right, I got it. We're going to line this up where we had it. Like this, and then like this, I think. Then we're going to build an assembler, which is already one away. So then these AI limiters come in. Oh, goodness. Turn you around. So the staters come up this way. Go in. These come down. And that goes in. That's snug, but, well, no, it's just snug. All right, let's look at this. Is there a way that I could put this on my to-do list? Beautiful. Computer, AI limiter, and high-speed connector. So there are our four components. The one thing we do know is that we want this one to be AI limiter. Now we got to go find all this stuff. I brag about the ease of use on the belt all the time so I have to, I feel obligated to show you what it's like to actually use it when it's not perfectly convenient it's always convenient it's just not perfectly convenient right now I have to extend this AI limiter out And have I built high-speed connectors yet? I feel like I've seen those little green. But maybe I haven't. Hmm. There's really no way to tell. If I don't see it on the belt. 
let's look and see what the high speed connector recipes are. Maybe that'll jog my memory. A manufacturer with silica. I bet you I've used that. Um, what do high speed connectors help you build? Well, maybe I have it. Hmm. Okay. That's going to slow us down a bit. Just double checking, making sure I'm not using are producing any high-speed connectors anywhere. The last option that I would have is this if I use, well, let's check automated wiring. I do have the recipe for it. not impossible no nope. don't think I have high-speed connectors okay easy enough my last manufacturer over here. Right. That's where I was making compacted coal. Hmm. Okay. We're going to have to build some high-speed connectors, I suppose. I don't know where I built automated wiring, but Okay, well, that is going to be an annoyance, an annoyance at best and at worst. Let's check the recipes for high-speed connectors. Quick wire is going to be a problem. We're consuming a good chunk of the quick wire already. Like a good chunk of it. We haven't filled the belt yet though, so there's room to improve. I 
I think I want to go with the quick wire cable. Why would I go with the slower recipe? Sixty quick wire makes three. No, sixty quick wire makes two high speed connectors. Or fifty six quick wire makes one. Well, that's the reason. It's way more efficient on the quick wire side. I burned through twice as many circuit boards, but I think that's okay. We're going to have to build a little bit of infrastructure to get this going. Okay, nothing that we need there. Let's just put ourselves, let's, let's put ourselves down and then come back for what we need. At least this way we know exactly what we're looking for. So, manufacturer. Try to snuggle it in a little bit here. So we can get it straight in there if we can. And we're gonna go with the silicon version. And we need to pull three things off this belt or off the bus. Quick wires, silica, and circuit boards. Quick wire, we know where that is. Let's do that first. Uh-oh. Did I miss a... Oh, this is a short one. Hmm. Don't like that. Okay, there's our quick wire. It's not gonna be a lot, but it's gonna be what we've got. And then we need silica and circuit boards. <laughs> what is that? Steel pipe. Yeah, we definitely need to make some more steel pipes. Quick wire, ready to go, silica. Hmm. This is interesting. Oh wait, I think I see the silica over here. There they are. Got it. Silica. 
And then the last thing we're looking for are circuit boards. All right. I think the circuit boards are probably, I mean, they have to be on this unlifted line here, right? There they are. Let's just go ahead and land. Just over it. This is good because we also need computers for the next part. And there we go. We're not going to do all of these, just a one extra. There are our circuit boards. Come on. Okay, we now have circuit boards in place. Maybe. No, it looks like we need to connect them way the heck over here. So we need to go one more level. Sorry for the silent building, it's just we need to just kind of knock this out. Let me refresh my memory here. Quick wire silica circuit boards. Quick wire silica circuit boards. And you know what? While I'm here, I'm going to grab some extra sheets so I can keep building belts. It's kind of the advantage of inline storage. All right. Quick wire silica circuit boards. There's your silica. There's your circuit boards. And there's your quick wire. What? Okay, and then we need a 
belt to drop the high speed connectors on. target for that is here. Let's put a merger on our target belt. Hmm. I find that lock to be suspect. I don't believe that that's working. I'm going to take this off build a merger and then connect it manually. I've been burned enough times. Then we'll do we'll add another merger. Right here. Uh, you know, the advantage of going high first is that it's less stuff on the ground. Wait, what? Why are you doing that? Merge. Ah. That's why. like one click away on the angle on that, but we're going to let it stand for now. Okay, so we're done. We've added the quick wire to the belt. Now we've got a... No, wait. We've added the high-speed connectors to the belt. Now we got to get these three things over here. Let's put down splitter, probably better, right? out of boring plates again. What? This method is foolproof. What happened? There we go.
All right, now I have to get. I think the silica on the bottom is an absolute clear winner. And then quick wire to the top. No, it would have to be this to the top. Okay, I need to grab some plates. What's my inventory look like? All right. I should probably put like a little internal storage in here for these basic materials. Oh, reinforced plates, not the plates I wanted. <sighs> you know what? I did put in this brand new transportation tube. Let's use that. That vehicle goes sliding out. I think that's because I'm on concrete. Yeah, this tube was a great idea. See, while I'm on this high grip fix it floor. I don't go sliding, but when I exit on the concrete, I go sliding. It's kind of funny. All right, let's see. And we're right back at it. That's good timing. We will put a splitter here. And one here and then we will go to the roof and then on this one we'll go to the roof minus so that's roof one two click One of these will have to enter on the side. Oh, that means I can't build this machine here. Or I might have to do something very interesting. So the problem is, is that this entry point Yeah, I'll, let me take out this middle. And put you back in, but have you enter. On this side. And then have you go up. To the roof and if you go up to the roof minus two nice So 
hook this up with power and we're ready to go. One moment. Sorry about that. All right, so now we're making high-speed connectors. Three per minute. What is our supercomputer requirement for high-speed connectors? Five point six per minute and that's going to create effectively two per minute and we want 50 more all right so we need to build a few more of these we might run out of materials to build machines now nah, we'll be all right I think that's it. Oh, we can squeeze in one more. to get some power down there all right let's see we're gonna connect you like this and you like this what do you say what do you say I will accept what I'm being told and build some power Where are you connected? Right there. There we go. Now I can keep fly. Uh, these are all in the way. I'm going to have to rebuild all that. It was like, if you wanted to build power poles that were guaranteed to clip on the belt, then I did it successfully. 100%. Okay, let's see here. you here okay and then what 
whatever recipe you're using, we want to use it on the rest of these. Okay. And then... We will pull in and split off here. Exactly. And we'll do it again. Connect this little mini bus. Double back. Hmm, I'm trying to think of a. Probably best to build the bottom one first. Yes. Yeah, quick wire is going to be a problem. So much so, I don't even have any on me. But the good news is, actually, you know what? I'm gonna take this whole stack of quick wire and put it at the bottom. Ninety per minute. Oh my goodness, that's too much. Even if I totally and completely filled the belt, I, I probably need like a secondary quick wire belt. If I had this to do over again, I might consider, let's see what the recipe looks like. Yeah. This is a very dense product. One to five or six to 12. Screws all over again. I should have included Caterium ingots on the belt, but I only sent 
I only sent require in my tiniest of factories right there. That's the miner, that's the smelters. Those are the machines making the quick wire. Gonna have to send more quick wire. I guess we can make this a high speed connector belt or video and Let's double back and check some of those issues. So we have extra, extra, extra. We're not burning any quick wire at this point. 41 coupons. Yeah, we'll take that. I'm only making 80,000 coupons a minute. Let's see. Hopefully we can make it to this. Oof, just barely. We've got one, not even fully overclocked power shard. Well, these things are struggling to keep up. This one probably doesn't have any power shards, so it's taking forever. But is that on purpose? Yeah, because these three right here, they're putting together 450 units per minute into the box, but then they're immediately getting shipped off down and over there. I mean, if I had some power shards, it'd probably be helpful here. I could speed this one up. But the belts can only handle 780. Well, actually, 780s. That's kind of a lot, actually. I need to go explore and find some some power shards. So this one is doing 270. Now it's doing 360. So that's 360 minus 270. That's an extra 90 ore. Two of these can do take care of that extra 90 ore. This isn't going to be pretty. So no matter how you count it, this machine is simply outputting 90 more ore. 
and this will consume 90 more ore. Always have fun time with the directions in this game. That should be pretty close to perfect. Each one of these machines is getting is guaranteed the first one third. And they are fully gassed up. Yeah, if I pulled this whatever or yeah. So 360 at best. 112 and a half times 112 and a half or times two. Plus 45 plus 45 plus 45. So you're saying I can do one more? Told you it wasn't going to be pretty. collecting any extra ingots over here we're consuming the full 360 360 divided by 45 times 15 we need to consume 120 We're currently consuming 90. And these things are fully overclocked. Good grief.
quick wire, ironically, it's hard to build. It takes a long time. It's taking on 12 ingots, but every ingot that is being sent in is getting used, which is not right, can't be right. Just want to test this to see if I'll get any ingots sent my way. Eventually, this is going to back up. Did I just pick up a bunch of ingots? Where in the heck did they go? I know you can see them. There we go. We'll merge this and just send it to the top. This whole thing needs a redo. It's just so slow. Five quick wire every 60, 60 per minute. So one quick wire a second. See, this bottom layer is starting to back up, which means it'll back up into the container, and this one will get some additional flow. I think once we get level 3 miners, we'll come back for this. Because this is about to be spaghetti if I keep going.
All right, well, for now anyway, we've added some quick wire to the belt. Like I said, we will have to come back and we'll have to get some. power shards. We'll have to get some upgraded everything, basically. Hi, train. What's up? I'm just gonna rob these and shift the spoils over here. So all the machines can get going. And I'll dump the extra ingots back in here. All right, yep, perfect. We added another, what, 120 quick wire per minute to the belt. So that's helpful. Oh wow, look at those lights. They are powerful and strong. All right, I know that we start off about to do one thing and ended up doing another. Huh. Guess I'll go up over here. Turn my gear light on here. All right, so we're over here looking at our quick wire. Yeah, I mean, it definitely looks better than it did before. Our last machine is still probably using the quick wire we gave it. And this one just about to get enough to run yeah so the problem is is we're using at least 450 per minute in quick wire alone it almost would have been better to send in the Caterium ingots and build the quick wire closer to the to the need but for now, we'll suffer through what we've got and fill the belt. Quick wire is the screws of this tier. Basically, as much as you need screws, you need quick wire. Good to know. All right. All that to say. Yeah, I think we're going to call that a video. We're going to call that the high-speed connector video. We did get those done. They are connected, and we are ready to connect to our other items to get those going. So I'm going to call that, and I'm going to say thanks for hanging out. I do appreciate it, and we'll see you next time.